Hey guys, so I am back with another packing video. It's been a while. I didn't have anything new for you, so um, I finally got something in the mail yesterday that I immediately packed up and got to try for the first time today. So I figured I would do a packing video to show you what it is and give you a little review on it and how I liked it. Um, so we just got back. Um, we had a few errands to run this morning, uh, only for about two hours or so. So I packed only what was needed. This is my probably my favorite diaper bag for short trips. I love it. I love being hands free with the backpack. Um, it just makes things a little bit easier with the two little ones. Um, so what is new is a it's called a slim bag in a bag. Um, now on Monday I got um, well an ad popped up in my Facebook news feed for my makeup brush set. .ca and it was for the slim bag in a bag for $4.99 um, so I've been looking for something like this to help try and keep um, my super bee and my mini bees uh, a little bit more organized so I clicked on it and at the time they had a, d a coupon code so I ended up getting it for $3.99 um, shipping was actually more than the bag itself <laughs> so in total I ended up paying $9.99 which is still fantastic um, so I ordered it and I think it got delivered like two days later. So it was really, really quick shipping. Um, so I'm just gonna get into what's in this bag and give you a little more information on the Slim Bag in a Bag. So in this front pocket here, I have um, my little notebook with my grocery list. We went to Costco, so I had to write down everything so I didn't forget. I have my wallet and a pack of wet ones and a pack of wipes. And that's all that's in there. And then on the inside is the bag in a bag. So it took me a while to actually figure out the best way to organize everything in here with the bag in a bag. Um, I still feel like I could probably do a better job, but it'll take a couple tries and a couple outings to figure out what's gonna work the best. But for now, this works pretty well. So, it has two handles, which makes it pretty easy to grab. Just move this out of the way. So, there it is. Um, I got it in the blue, and I um, always read reviews before I buy something, and some people were saying that the colors weren't exactly the same as um, the pictures that you saw on the site. This light blue is pretty true to the color on the... Um, website. So I got this and it has four uh, smaller mesh pockets on one side with two bigger pockets behind and then on the other side it has two larger mesh pockets with the same um, two pockets on this side. Then turn it this way along the top here there is a zipper pocket and the same with the bottom here and then of course you have the inside pocket so um, first impression the material felt a little cheap um, there are some sections let's see you can't see it right now but there's a little bit of like pulling with the thread I feel like if you stuff it too much the thread can tear the fabric um, but I mean I paid four dollars for it so I would buy another one <laughs> for four dollars you can't really go wrong um, the other thing I will note is that when you pack these all of these pockets unless you're packing them with things that are really really thin it gives you little room to work with on the inside um, so that's just something to note with this bag so this is how I have it packed um, I have two packs of vitamin C on this side because my daughter and my husband are both sick so I have been taking these because I don't want to get sick because I don't want to get the little one sick, um, my two and a half month old sick. And of course, it never fails. They are starting to get better and I'm starting to feel sick. So I'm drinking some right now. It's not the prettiest color, but I'm hoping it'll help. Um, I have an extra diaper cream, my daughter's sunglasses, two extra packets of baby formula, I have my small set piece, and this is where I just keep 
coupons and gift cards and then a coin purse with cash and coins. And then on the other back pocket here, I just have a few little snacks. So I have a pouch for my two and a half year old, a fruits, uh, fruit to go bar and just a little um, Love Child Organics granola bar kind of thing. And this is really handy because um, I was just able to quickly open the bag and pull something out for her. <laughs> so it was really, really handy, really easy to get at. And then on the other side is kind of like my little first aid emergency side. Um, so I just have my little manicure set from Claire's. I have a tie to go pen. Oops, I have my C ammo coin purse just filled with hair clips, elastics, bobby pins, headbands. Then I have a thermometer and my little eerie pouch made by Mellow Indie and this I use as a mini first aid kit. So if you've watched any of my other packing videos you would probably have seen this before. So let's get into the inside first. So the only things I could really fit on the inside here was a travel on packing square. This is from the smaller set and this is the large piece I believe from that set. And this is just change of clothes. So I have a dress in 3T for my two and a half year old. And then I have an outfit that is a onesie pair of pants and the matching sweater in three months for my two and a half month old. Oh, there's also a pair of socks in here in the back pocket. Then, oh, I did not realize she was in here. <laughs> I have, because we were only going out for, you know, about an hour and a half, two hours, I just packed one bottle and then just one cube from the Munchkin Snack Tower with formula. So that fit in there just kind of like that. And then, in the one zipper pocket here, I found I couldn't put a lot in here because if I did, then I wouldn't really be able to fit much in here. So it's just a pack of Kleenex, pack of gum, and keys. Let's take this stuff out. Then on the other side in the zipper pocket, it's immunization records, health card, birth certificate, stuff like that in here. So, that is all I kept in there. As you can see, like there's quite a bit more room in here when the outside pockets aren't packed. Um, but I really did like um, all the little pockets on the outside because it made it really easy to grab things. And I could put on like the outside what I knew I was going to need while I was out or most likely need while I was out. Um, and then it was still easy to grab the stuff that was at the back. Or I could always just lift it out and uh, get what I needed. Or get what was underneath it, which was another travel on packing square. And this is from the larger set. And if you've watched my um, Be Prepared packing video for um, an overnight trip with the two girls, I used the larger set for that and I really liked it. Um, and this is just diapering needs. So it's wipes, two size five diapers and two size one diapers and just a little pseudo cream. So that is everything that I had packed in my mini bee for a trip out today with the little slim bag in a bag. Oh, I also wanted to note that it has snaps on the side. Again, they feel kind of cheap, but four or five dollars, what are you gonna do? So if you, you know, just wanted to use the outside pockets for organization, or if you just had something really slim, like you had a Kindle or a Kobo or something, um, you just needed to slide in here, you're using this for your purse instead of a diaper bag, that's really handy. Um, so it doesn't take up that much room. It gets pretty slim. So anyways, I did like this. I could definitely see myself purchasing another one of these in the future. I mean, for the price, you can't really go wrong. 
So anyways, that was my packing video with my new slim bag in a bag. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful and we will talk to you guys next time. Bye. Hey guys. So I wanted to thank you for watching my packing video with the slim bag in a bag. And I also wanted to mention that it is giveaway time over on the Little Chicken Charlie Facebook page. Now this, <laughs> if you watch any of my videos, it's no surprise that I love Jujube and I love the Oh She Glows cookbook and blog. Every recipe that I've made from this book, I've loved, my family has loved. It's a vegan cookbook. We are not vegan but I feel like anybody, vegan, vegetarian, um, if you eat meat, everyone can find something in this book that they will love. So if you head on over to the Little Chicken Charlie Facebook page, I will post a link to it in the description box down below. You can get a chance to win the Oh She Glows cookbook and this adorable little duo pouch CMO duo pouch by the talented mellow indie it is CMO print on one side with zipper across the middle and the little jujube tokidoki zipper pull and vinyl on the other side this is adorable for um, like a little first aid kit or even a little pencil case for your child school is starting very soon for most of the kids all right, so if you want to head over to the Little Chicken Charlie Facebook page, all of the instructions on how to enter are there. This is, at the time, only open to Canadian residents. I'm hoping as my YouTube page grows and my Facebook page grows that I will be able to continue doing giveaways and, you know, um, branch out a little bit, do giveaways for all of North America and then hopefully the rest of the world. <laughs> But unfortunately, for right now, it is for Canadian residents only. But if you still want to head over and check out the Facebook page, I do post different things over there. Good luck, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.